So, hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zum Let's Play von Tales from the Borderlands. Jetzt endlich mit Episode 5 und damit auch mit der letzten Episode von unserem Borderlands Spiel von Telltale. Ich bin gespannt, wie es ab, wie es weitergeht, weil wir ja doch relativ viele Eskalationen hatten im letzten Spiel. Von daher lassen wir uns einfach mal überraschen, was jetzt hier passiert. Here hier we are at the finale. Or should I say, finally, huh? <laughs> yeah, whatever. I don't write this stuff. If you recall, the long journey to the Vault of the Traveler actually began by accident. Atlas's gorgeous robot was designed to not only summon the Vault of the Traveler, it was also meant to deal with the complications of entering the Vault. Two unlikely Vault Hunters began to assemble it, but one component remained out of reach on a Hyperion space station. Pressed into service by the local crime lord, they concocted a plan to sneak aboard. The sisters were enraged when the corporate lackey revealed his secret, but there was no backing up now. An old rival provided a priceless disguise, <laughs> while new allies helped cobble together a rummage sale lady, rocket you ship. Have yourself a rocket. Once again, tempting fate, they flung themselves into space. Indeed, they would have died up there, were it not for the sacrifice of a noble soul. Finally aboard the space station, The salary man found himself contending with his ambitious former accomplice. Choosing his words carefully, he managed to maintain his disguise. Working together, the con artist and the salary man managed one last miracle and acquired the final Cortis component. But just then, Handsome Jack offered the salary man everything he had ever wanted. How could he possibly refuse? Oh, she's <laughs> abled. <laughs> What a mess. <laughs> oh, middles. Put them in one of the cells for questioning. Look at the three of us! Living a life of crime! <laughs> <sighs> What are you in for? They got me at one of the security checkpoints. No, God is. We're here because we shot Pony! Uh, <laughs> what? We all know about the plan. We intercepted your comms. So. Oh, cool! So we don't have to explain it. Where's Reese? A lot of strange things have been happening today. And I just need to talk to him. No. We're looking for him too! If that helps. Thanks. It doesn't. We're not leaving here until I start getting some answers. What the hell is that? Get them into the cell. Hey, President Asshole, what's taking so long? Reese! What is going on up there? I don't know, it's the last time that it escalated. Let's get dirty! Let's get dirty! I can't believe it. What? That you're finally in charge? Don't be surprised, kid. I mean, not to sound like a frickin' shampoo commercial here, but you deserve it because you killed a lot of people to get here. But listen, I know where you're coming from. A little imposter syndrome's normal when you've basically just become a god. Okay, I don't get it. Why me? Oh, well, partly because you slammed me into your left temple a while ago, but mainly because you're kind of a badass kid. You survived Pandora, you survived Helios, and you never let anything get in the way of what you wanted. Kind of reminded me of myself, actually. What? Gotta say, I'm kind of surprised, though. I thought you couldn't stand me there for a while. And hell, you know what? Maybe you still don't. 
but you finally recognized we could do some good together, and I respect that a hell of a lot more than if you've been sucking my toes from the get-go. But enough talking, am I right? It's time for you to make your first command as president, Reese. You gotta project power. You gotta project vision. But you also want to convince the toadies that you care about them. That's important. Yeah, uh, how exactly do I do that? Oh, that's such a good question. You are on the ball today, Reese. Here, given the current corporate landscape, there's three big changes you could make right here, right now. Which ones are gonna be? What? Uh, uh, pizza? What? What? Uh, Show force moonshot abandoned camp. Pizza bestellen. Balance ledger. Fire the accounting crew. Uh, uh, pizza. Um, kinda hungry. Could go for a pepperoni pizza. You got it. Voll gut. Wow, that was fast. That's good, right? No. Oh, 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 oh. That just smells like happiness and garlic. Oh, I need this inside me right now. I know, right? Totally worth all the people you killed to get here, huh? Yes. <laughs> I mean, kind of, yeah. I see him too slowly, because this next project might make you choke to death, and we don't want that. What the hell? So, this is a sick ass endoskeleton that the Yama made for me. Oh, that thing has a body? I, I didn't thought it was just for holding coffee mugs or something. See, they were gonna put it inside my original body and then upload my consciousness into it, so I'll be wearing my old body like a skin suit. It's great, right? Ah, uh, creepy. Uh... That's insanely creepy. I know, right? But in a fun way. All right, now the one problem was how to get the endoskeleton into my body without killing me first. But since I'm dead anyway, I had a way cooler idea. Are you ready for this? This is awesome. We make a shitload of these endoskeletons, we put them into the corpses of the bandits we killed, and then we upload my AI into all of them. You want to make an army of jacks? Freaking awesome, right? I mean, Hyperion troops die in battle, grab the corpse, shove an endoskeleton into it, boom, another jack. Some asshole gives you lip, boom, jackpot. Successfully wipe out a bandit camp, you turn the corpses into more jacks. Within a few months, Hyperion would have the smartest, best looking fighting force in the universe. And the best part is, Reesey, baby, you're gonna be the first recipient. Huh? I don't think so, uh, no. Now I, I know metal skeleton forcing its way into your body. No, Arr, no, scary idea. no, no, no. What the hell is wrong with you? There is no way I am doing that. Uh, detecting a little ingratitude here, Reese. I did make you present. So what? Come on. Remember how good that pizza was? No? Huh? Right? If I'm being honest, Backing out after you got to have your fun? Huh? Kind of a... kind of a dick move. <laughs> I don't know what I ever saw in you. You're nuts. Oh, you used to worship me, kid. What the hell happened? You had it right the first time. But you know what? Knowing how you feel now just makes it that much easier to kill you. I am taking the beacon and getting out of here. I saw. This was your chance to make history, you moron. To be part of a legacy. Just for the record, I am way more handsome than you are. Yes! <laughs> hell yeah! Oh, hell no! Oh, hell yeah. Ooh. Come, Sean. Well, oh, shit. Please, come on. We need to go. Yeah, not an option. We still don't have the beacon. He's not coming. You heard the announcement. Reese made his choice. Still, 
A promise is a promise. No one promised anyone anything. No, is You don't know what's going on. We said we'd meet him here, so that's what we're doing. Yeah, hello. Yeah, sometimes things are complicated. Once Hyperion, always Hyperion. Warning lockdown protocol in effect. Okay. <laughs> no! Okay, now we really have to go. Come on, hang our this way. Do you know what you'd be right now without me? <laughs> Nothing! Nobody turns their back on me unless they want me to sink an axe into it, you ungrateful shit! Oh, I am not gonna forget this. Uh, Fiona, Sasha, Bon, they're all dead. Anyone you've ever cared about. And once they're dead, I'm going to make them my flesh bots. And you're gonna watch as your best friends tear you limb from freaking limb. Oh my body. It hurts inside my body. No reason. Okay, so I'm guessing the president thing didn't go over so well. That's that's fine. Yeah, that's just fine. Ow. Reese, we got a problem. Oh, cool, dude. Add it to the list. The hangar bay door's just locked tighter than a bully monk's jaw. The caravan ain't going nowhere. Awesome. That's awesome. Okay, uh. I'll override it at the power core. Just give me a minute to get my ribs. Ooh, okay. <sighs> okay. I can do this. Reese. I'm so sorry. Yvette? Ah, Yvette. Well, hello, Yvette. Listen, Reese, I gave Hyperion your coordinates because they gave me a guarantee. Guarantee? Oh, that we would have a painful death? Is that the guarantee? That you'd be safe. They wanted to kill you and rip some top secret file out of your head. I made sure they spared you. Please, Reese. I'm as good as dead if you leave me. Please don't do this. No. no. Fuck you. Reese! Please! I'm sorry, okay? Come on! Like you never screwed someone over for a promotion! Nee, vergiss es. Reese! Also, nee, vergiss es. Reese! Nee. Hallo! Die hat mich übelst veräppelt, die Frau. Vergiss es, so scheiß macht man nicht mit der Kitty. No way. Come on! This way! Hey, kiddos! Daddy's home! What's going on? Yes, dare to dream, it's me, Handsome Jack, your favorite. I'm back in the digital flesh, baby, and I need you to help me find my very good friend. Whatever it is, it can't be good. Hey, everybody. You remember that guy, Reese, the new president, the less handsome guy? Well, he is that gentle Jim? That Gordas is Handsome Jack. Oh. What did I say? <laughs> I just can't find him. But I, I just can't find the guy. So, if you yeah, see so. him, why don't you do Uncle Jack a favor and bring him to me, huh? No rush. We need to get to the hangar bay. Now. Big rush. Just can't wait to see the guy, you know? I just love him. Hey, hey, you idiot. You look like the kind of moron that hangs out with middle management. Do you know where he sends? I, uh... Is he the one with the glasses? Oh, it's or... <laughs> <laughs> Time to go. I don't know. Just had yeah, you know, check, even yeah? though it's full of flesh-eating monsters, Pandora suddenly feels a lot safer than here. Someday, I want to live on a nice planet. Good luck with that. Hello, oh, ladies. Great. So, how are things? Still alive, I see. Well done. Uh, just a quick quest for you both. Where the hell is Reese? I got every single Helios employee looking for that ass clown. So save him some major calf strain and turn him in already. Last I heard, he was in your old office. Uh, trust me, Cupcake, he ain't in there. Otherwise, I'd be inside him. Oh, God. Let's go, Fiona. He can't touch us. Well, you are just 100% right about that, Pumpkin. I can't, but my guards and their bullets sure can, and a shit ton of them are heading to you right now. Could get messy. 
So in the essence of saving on cleanup costs, why don't we just figure this out together, huh? I mean, I'll be straight with you, Reese is definitely gonna die. But you don't have to. I mean, I don't care enough about you to kill you. No way in hell I'm trusting the douchebag who tried to destroy my planet. Oh, wow. <laughs> really? Douchebag? <laughs> Such a hateful word. That's why I used it. Douchebag. Oh, here are my guards. Now remember, you had a chance to avoid this next part. You think on that while you're headbutting bullets. Lot of monitors in this place. Whoa. I, oh, oh, whoa, yeah. Well, it's the too. Killing previous fear. Take Okay, I can do this. Just gotta hack into the central systems, reverse the lockdown, and get the hell out of here. <laughs> no problem. Push the button. Ah, uh, open. Warning. Oh, detected. come on! Warning. Okay, okay, wanna dance? <laughs> Alright, I am in and boom! The hangar bay doors are now open. <laughs> You shouldn't have hacked into Helios and tickled my alarms, pal. Led me right to you. And I hate being tickled. No, that's not true. I love it. You're my hero, Jack. But I gotta shut you down. Uh, never meet your heroes, kid. They're all dicks. Every last one of them. All right, Jack. You want to shut me out of the computer systems? Fine. I'll go right to the source. Let's see how long you survive without a power core. Yes. Nico. Ah! I am glad you're out of my brain so I can finally kill you. Back off, Reese. Don't you even try to shut me down. Uh, you know what? Your puny little body isn't worth all this trouble. Seriously. Core venting process initiated. It's going to be way more fun watching you get vented into space. Oh shit, that's bad. That's really, 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 really bad. Ooh. Warning, airlocks in the Building a Better Life seminar. Failing. 12,000 hopeful attendees vented into space. <laughs> oh, you're gonna kill me with that lightning rod? I'm made of electricity, you idiot. You didn't actually think it would be that easy, did you, idiot? Power core damage reaching critical. Enjoy your last few seconds of not being dead. Mm -hmm. Stand by for core ventilation in three, two, okay. one. Go, go, go! Core ventilation in progress. Ah! Oh, <laughs> have you learned nothing? I may not exist in this current form, baby, but I'm a legend, kid. And unlike you, when you're gone, it's for good. Yeah, I know. Emmy, right? You twirl on that one for a bit. Without me, you're nothing. Just a sad, silent vacuum of space waiting to be filled with a handsome end of yeah. Yeah. Warning. Ventilation aborted. Room repressurizing. Jack! Eat it all! Retro rockets activated. Helios thrusters offline. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Where are you going? You can't leave me here! Impact with Pandora imminent. Please begin evacuation procedures. Oh, you little asshole! Look what you have done! <laughs> Body alt.
Great. These idiots. Hey, August. We got problems. Hangar door shut a few minutes ago. The whole base is on lockdown. 